Apparently we had some issues with the last video uploading properly and I don't know when that copyrighted joy. Um, but anyway, today we're going to Kiyo Mizudera and I've learned my lesson to never upload things. Um, never upload things outside of my home Wi-Fi ever again. And also not to record arcades. So with that said, let's go. Um, right now I'm kind of just looking around. There's a lot here actually. Um, this is where you can put plates with wishes. I believe those cost money actually. Um, go ahead and use awkward. And at least you can cleanse yourself ceremonially. It's actually very simple for us to record it in an earlier video, I believe. But since it wasn't, since some of my videos aren't working, just in case, I'm going to record this. That's how you do it, basically. Here's <laughs> uh, one of the villains in the temple. <laughs> There are only a lot of temples with this color. And uh, this is probably where a hanging plant would be growing later, earlier in the year. And here we go into the Kiyomizadera. I don't know if I'm supposed to record anything. As you can see, there's a construction. A lot of temples are right now. I don't know if it's just bad luck on my part. Um, regardless, I'll see what I can record on here. Ooh. It's going in since for a while, but I wasn't sure where it was coming from for a while. Pretty um, cool area, honestly. This is huge all up here. Um, I got installed under construction. I have to, and if I want to go in there and look around, I have to take off my shoes. So I will be doing that. I can wear a kid with uh, 500 yen from the looks of it. I'm like in, say, Catholicism mode where I can make this way, but either in an honor of someone else or for um, Jesus, basically. Uh, you light those candles, which you can see here, to make a wish. Um, so five dollars to make a wish. Um, it's a little pricey for me. Ten yen, ten which is about nine cents USD. Can feel the heat. Uh, there we go. Like till it stops burning. Mm -hmm. uh, right. Sitting there. Yay. When you do an omikuji, if you get a bad fortune, you have to tie it on here. That's never happened to me though. Thankfully, I'm not gonna push my luck. Oh, up here is apparently something called a love stone, um, where you go for good luck in relationships. So, uh, and there's also a shrine for marriage relationships and all that. Don't. What are you doing? It's tempting. I like it, but I feel like I'm so sweet. Yeah. So, uh, mm. 
It's a pretty area. Mm -hmm. so apparently how the last time works is you close your eyes, think of the person you want to meet, or your significant other, and you go all the way over there, and if you don't bump into anybody, you touch the stone with your eyes closed, you did it. You can get helpful. <laughs> So it's not too bad, actually. <laughs> I actually managed to do it. I had help, of course. <laughs> it was fun. Definitely worth a try. <laughs> and we're going towards the waterfall now. The view here, though, is absolutely lovely. This is honestly such a fun place to be. Definitely, I'm gonna come back one day. You go up to this uh, fountain, which I believe comes from a waterfall, maybe? At any rate, you can drink it, and cleansing here will bring you good fortune. So, we're gonna try that in just a little bit. Yeah, folks, the two of our classmates are about to be uh, ceremonially cleansed with um, the water from the waterfall. It's actually really tasty. I think we're allowed to drink it. I didn't drink much anyway, just in case. <laughs> ah, there they go. There they go. <laughs> This pond has koi and turtles and is therefore awesome. So yeah, go to Kiyomiza dinner. Everything is great. <laughs> He's asleep, I wouldn't wake him. He went to the Arayashima, I think, uh, owl shop. Yes, yes. They're not always very friendly. Hello. Yeah, your feathers are all ruffled. You don't want to be petted, huh? Okay. I can respect that. This one is... Oh, Teramati, and it, it's very territorial. Just relax, Owl. We ain't gonna do nothing. This one really doesn't like me and I'm scared. Can you guys move? <laughs> this one really doesn't like me. This one is named Ohimiya. And I don't think it wants to be petted either. It made a noise at somebody earlier. I don't know what you can do about it. You can try and pet it if you want, but I don't think it's a good idea. Yeah, this one tried biting someone right now. There's another two in here. They're so cute. Yeah, no, fluffy. Oh, can I? Oh, can I pet you too? These ones are little eyes. No, they're just a small breed. It's all. Uh, I think. And this one's a great horned owl named Kamanza. It, I don't think it likes me. Either that or it's just staring. Mm -hmm. This one's a common scoff's own. No. Okay, I don't think so. I'm too scared. Black banded owl named uh, Kuromon. Hi. You want a picture? There's more. Can I pet you? Oh, you're not a big fan of that. Okay. <laughs> so, so cute. Oh, what a cutie. It doesn't want to be petted or. I'm trying to pet you. If you're too hesitant, it'll freak out too. Doesn't seem to mind too much. It's like, hmm, I'm not sure. Can I pet you? Oh, nope. Okay. No, I, it turned its head. 
only one pet, then it's like, no. No, I, you stop now. Okay. Tiet. Its name is Tiet. is definitely interesting. Got another owl up here. Wow. They have a tiny squirrel forest with, you know, 100 yen food for the squirrels. This one doesn't like to be touched, but you can't really see it because this thing has a very weird lighting aspect. Silhouette. This one's a white faced owl. Are you up for padding? No? No? Okay, that's fine. It's still so cute. Mm. Yeah, that one's the Eurasian Eagle Owl. Its name is Inokuma. <laughs> Hi, Inokuma. <laughs> oh, that old guy is adorable. Say hi again for the cameras. That can barely see you. <laughs> How cute! Can I, no, you don't want to be petted either. His name's Takakura. It's a spotted eagle owl. Oh. Looks like this is the exit. Is that it? Ah. Looks like that was it. It's pretty short, huh? They also have one for uh, Bengal cats. So, if you ever find yourself in Arashiyama, it's definitely with a look. Oh, cute. Uh, today we went into the Arashiyama bamboo forest, which is a lovely, lovely place. Oh. Today for part of our trip, we are going to the Arashiyama bamboo forest. Oh, oh there's a cyclist. <laughs> it's really lovely. It's hard to tell exactly, but... If you're from California, you might find this site somewhat familiar. They're as tall as redwood trees. Still very lovely. People are riding some cool boats. This is again in a, uh, the Arashiyama bamboo forest. By the river, though, much more peaceful. Wow, that's sorry. There's an ice cream vending machine. Awesome. There's multiple vending machines for ice cream. Uh, yeah, no, I'm distracted. We are going to the Kinkokuji Temple today, or the Golden Temple. It's absolutely beautiful, I'm sure. I mean, it's it's friggin' golden, so I will see you in a bit. Alright, and we're almost to the Kinkakuchi Temple. It's, you can't see it because there's a tree in the way, but it's very beautiful. They have guards at the line. <laughs> I guess it makes sense. I gotta keep everything in order. I can't really see it until I see it here. Oh, I'll record again when I have a better body. It's not very much, but you can see the Golden Temple from here, and it's, well, it's freaking golden. It's pretty. It's amazing. I'm gonna record this a little more just so I can see. 
Hopefully we'll get some more angles. <laughs> Only time will tell. This is the best angle by far. Very pretty. Definitely perfect spot. Like we got very lucky in finding this one. Getting a little closer to the top. Maybe we'll get to go in? Probably not. It's awesome. I can see a waterfall over there. But other than that, it's you know from King Kukuchi Temple for most of it. We only had an hour here though, so it's been entirely surprising. Um, I may just go try out those ice cream machines with my time left over. Yeah.